uh, today is 16th August Wednesday and it's currently 7.32 and I'm starting off very late because uh, I slept till 7 as I had come back from school I was very very tired so yeah I slept a little more <laughs> so okay uh, this is my to-do list for today I'm doing metals and non-metals I have done half of the lecture so I'm doing the rest half of the lecture then I'll do maths only for one hour today because I have a lot of agriculture notes to make and I have my copy checking tomorrow only and then I'll do the life processes revision so yeah let's start by the way uh, let's put on uh, a timer of one hour as we are starting off with maths So you guys have been asking me about my syllabus. So let me go subject wise. From maths, I have completed real numbers, polynomials, linear equations in two variables, surface area and volume, trigonometry, introduction to trigonometry. And tri uh, I'm currently doing the chapter triangles. Now I'm really lagging behind in maths. And the main reason behind that is it takes me a lot of time to do one sum. And I am trying to increase that pace as soon as possible. From science, I have done chemical reactions and equations, acids, bases and salts, life processes, control and coordination, light, reflection and refraction, human eye and the colorful world, electricity and I am currently doing metals and non-metals. From SST, I have done nationalism in India, rise of nationalism in Europe, development, resources and development, forest and wildlife, power sharing, federalism, gender, religion and caste, water resources, agriculture and I am currently doing the sectors of Indian economy. So uh, now let's talk about how I'm preparing for my upcoming half yearly exams. Uh, my half yearly exams are from the 25th of September and these are obviously going to be of 80 marks. So uh, the first and the most important thing is I'm going to complete the whole syllabus and simultaneously I am practicing some questions and I'm also revising the notes of the chapters that I had in my previous exam because those chapters are also going to be there in the half yearly, right? So uh, basically, if you had seen my last video, you had seen me practicing the questions of acids, bases and salts and today I revised the life processes and I'm also going to uh, do the questions of the chapter life processes tomorrow so this is what i'm doing and i'm trying to revise a few chapters every week and evaluating your mistakes is also very important make sure that the mistakes you did in your last exam you don't repeat them right because repeating your mistakes is not a very good thing so make sure that you focus on every single topic just because the topic is easier for you does not necessarily mean that you are going to divert all your attention to another topic right make sure that you give that easy topic the attention it deserves as well otherwise you may just lose all your marks in that topic right so please uh, practice a lot of questions because question practicing is also very important just revising your notes and just completing the chapters is not sufficient so please make sure that you have uh, write the questions and answers and for SST Hindi English if you think that your answer writing skills are not that good please make sure that you uh, practice your answers by writing them and not just by saying them out loud so that's my plan for half yearly examinations what are your plans and how much syllabus have you completed do let me know in the comments section below and here I was doing my geography work and then I started revising the notes of life processes. So basically I was just revising the notes and in the places where I felt that I think I should read it from the NCRT as well. Only those places I was trying to revise from the NCRT. So it is currently 10.57 and I'm done with my studies for today and I've already marked it. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video everyone. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.